we can't make um, a lot of tools the way that we do with vanilla wine for Minecraft. So this is how we are going to be making our tools. Wide guard, hand guard, crossbar, tool binding. I think we know how to make a pickaxe from what we're seeing here. So we put that there. Pick up some wood. And if my guess is correct, and this is completely a guess. No, okay, that's actually that was dirt, not wood. Can I put wood on? Yep. Yeah. And that repairs it. So I put a piece of wood in there and that repairs it. Um modifiers remaining one, modifiers yeah, so I'm not modifying it. So that's repaired my pick. And I can put things in here also to modify it. So that's pretty good. Can we do that as well? Yes, we can. Excellent. So that can have modifiers on it too. Uh, my favorite emote is... That one, the vampire. We didn't look in here. I have no idea what to do there. We have to learn how to use that one. But okay, what's it looking like outside? Is it getting light? Oh look, that's working really well. That's excellent. And that tree is almost completely gone. So it looks like we're going to be getting lots of string in the morning. And the first thing we need to do here is make ourselves a couple of crooks, I think. Because they don't seem to last long because they're wooden tools. And we'll go and use those on the trees. Plant some more, get some more out. Just make sure there's no mobs. Yeah, there's no mobs. Um, hold on a sec, hold on a sec, let me get inside, because I'm paranoid. Blair. That one. The vampire. Okay, so a bit more of this. One, two, three. One, oh. Three. Okay, a bit there. Uh, utterly, utterly terrified of doing this because of the drop. Okay. On the bright side, come meet the pan of destiny. Yay! <laughs> it's okay. Right, so there. Stick a tree on there. Let's bone meal that up. And let's get some, let's get our last silkworm on there. That one's almost done, as is that one. So I think we're actually at a good point now where we can start getting some string. No, don't want to deal with him. Come around the corner. The last thing I want to do is knock back myself into oblivion. Come on. No. Oh. OK. 
Okay, going out was a bad idea. Getting this pan was a good idea. Right, okay, I'm going indoors. Oh, and I'm so glad I went indoors. <laughs> Right, okay, we're, we're stuck here till morning, unfortunately. I was hoping to make a bed, but uh, there's no way I'm going out there with that lot. In fact, let's unload some stuff, shall we? That might as well come out here somewhere. Oh, we got some bones, some extra bone meal. Excellent. Don't want to die with that on us. Okay, don't want that on us. Oh, we got some flint, which is excellent. So we can get some chickens. We can make ourselves some arrows. Chickens are fairly doable. We just need a bit of planning. Come on. Oh, sun's rising. Excellent. Got him. That's it. Come here, zombie. Come on. Gotcha. Get some of that experience. Ooh, yes. He. Right. Okay, it's dawn, <laughs> and we've managed to fry and pan most of our opponents out the window so let's go and get some string if we can and we'll start working towards that quest Yes, loads of string and loads of silkworms. This is working well. Right. And I shall beat this tree into submission with my bone. So what's going on in the chat while I was dodging skeletons and panicking blindly? Right, let's get another tree down and let's eat some apples. All right. There we go, we're no longer peckish, that's excellent. Right. And this one is fairly well gone as well. Oh, that just dropped an apple. Interesting. Okay, this one's just fairly well gone, so let's get this one. Yeah, that creeper really did give me lots of fun. I was very happy to see a creeper there. That is exactly what I needed at this point of the game. Something which not only can blow me over the world border, can actually create a hole in the world border and kill me. So, that has been really good. Okay, so all right, we're up to eight silkworms, so we're going to have plenty of them. Barbecue worms, yeah, okay, we'll do some barbecue worms later on. <laughs> right, uh, 
Come on, you. Right, we'll plant another tree here. We'll just let that one carry on maturing. Ha! Ah, you may try to escape, but you'll never get away from me, worm. We'll do that. Leave that there. Let's get rid of that block, because we don't need it. Um, actually, while I'm thinking about it, that little hole there quite terrifies me. So let's actually put a, um, a clay block there. Yeah. Right. Okay, we have lots of string. 56 string, to be precise. And let's see what we need to make. An oak sieve, a fishing rod, a wooden hammer, and a bed. I know how to make two of those. We'll have to look up the other two. So, start with the bed, shall we? One, two, three. You can make wool out of string. I've always loved that. So, like that, like that. Gives us a bed. And a fishing rod is one that... Every line drafter should remember well. Sticks. And two string. Give you a fishing rod. So the other two I'm going to have to look up. A sieve. Looks like that. So silk mesh. Looks like that. Okay, that's easy enough to do. So we need two of those. Not really a double negative, but my favourite is I could... And that really annoys me. <laughs> I hate to say it, but that really does frustrate me. I couldn't care less. I could care less means that you're actually bothered by it. <laughs> And finally, hammer time. Okay, and a wooden hammer is made like that. And yeah, okay, that looks a little bit rude. Let's move on quickly. Uh, doink, doink. A hammer. So that should give us everything we need. Yeah. So from this, we get a, an axe. Another quarter heart, and we pick pick between sugarcane seeds, cotton seeds, carrot seeds, and just plain old seeds. Oh, there's more to it. I think I'm actually going to get the sugarcane. Your first stone. Job well done. You've proven yourself that you can stay alive in this new world. The cute one might be impressed, but don't count on it. That you haven't killed yourself yet. Now. The time has come to get working with wood. Let's put those trees you've grown to some good use. So we need to make a cobblestone, which I'm going to assume we're going to use to use the sifter and put some earth in it. So let's go and do that quickly. Cotton. Okay, why, why should I do cotton? Why should I do cotton? Give me a good reason, or give me a funny reason, and I'll promise you I'll do it, okay? So we have five earth at the moment. And we sift through it, and that's given us five stone. And if I remember right, that's the recipe for cobblestone. Cotton because it's pink. Okay, that's a good enough reason. We'll go and get some cotton. I'm really sorry that the audio is cutting out. Is anyone else having this problem? Um, from my end, the stream is looking okay. Pink cotton seed selected. Claim the reward. Okay. And that gives us a lot of extra new rewards. Uh -huh. um, okay. Oh, well, we killed three zombies. I didn't realize. So there we go. That gives us some apples and half a heart. And I think if I remember right, we can actually craft a full heart out of this. So that gives us half a heart. And that gives us a full heart. Excellent. 
Hey, well done, Frankie. Congratulations on escaping. So we're up to four lives. Let's eat some of these uh, apples, get our hunger bar up. There we go, that's good. Right. So, my understanding is we can use these barrels to create earth. And we can put in them saplings or rotten meat or loads of other things. And they'll basically compost down to earth. I don't want to use the saplings at the moment because we're actually we don't have that many of them. But it's always an option. All right, so I want to keep at least that tree now just giving us saplings. Whereas this one is going to give us string. And I think I'll replant this one as well. It's probably going to give us enough string for now. So let's get this one replanted. Let's do all the way through this. Let's, let's not try to dig our way through that lantern. Okay. Get this tree down. Oh, bad me. We want string, so we want to use this. Grab all these. Let's take care not to walk too close to the end, um, the edge here. And in fact, we need to build ourselves up a little bit here. There we go. Right. Let's just get this all cleared through. Well, as much as we, we can get. Don't want to lose, well, don't want to bother with the stuff over the edge, to be honest with you. Just no point in it. I do like that. When the crook breaks, it just picks another one out of the inventory and gives it to me. I like that. Right, let's go and get this tree cut down. That's probably enough. And actually, given the fact it's getting dark, let's go and sleep in that brand new bed of ours and we'll do this. <gasps> eee! Ah, didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to jump there. <laughs> oh dear. Let's go and sleep and finish this off in the morning. <laughs> there we go. Right. Uh, yes, this is Agrarian Skies very very heavily modded minecrafts which i thought would make a change because we're we only ever really do bane of arthropods okay bit pointless but there you go we only i, I only did ever seem to do vanilla minecraft i thought this would make a change yeah that's that one cut down So now what I want to do is actually grow saplings, because I think we've got enough string for now. And what I want to do now is concentrate on getting stone and earth and things like that. And I think in order to do that, I'm probably going to have to make a mob drop, which is going to involve lots of wood. And it's probably going to take me the rest of the night to do, but it might well be worth it, I think. Right, okay, so. Oh, I didn't plant a tree. Let's go and plant a tree. Because otherwise the tree won't grow. From there, okay, so let's have a quick look at the quests that are open to us now. Yeah, well, that was, that was me um, basically embracing my inner little girl, to be honest with you. Not proud of that squeak, but that squeak happened nonetheless. 
Oh, one more apple. Let's just eat it. There we go. Right. Right, quests. No only sky block. Let's open this one up. We've currently died zero times, which is good. Alright, let's see what we, quest we have. We still have that one, which we're going to need to make paper from. So let's actually, let's have a quick look. Let's see how we can make a book binder. Book. Uh, book binder, there we go. Alright, so we need two string, two paper. Paper can be made out of wood chips or sugar cane. We're not going to be doing alchemy for a while. We're not going to be using the carpenter for a while. In fact, we're not going to be using any of this. So how do we make wood chips in the pulverizer? How do we make a pulverizer? Right, a pulverizer is that, and that's made with... Yeah, and I think that's a bit beyond us at the moment. When are we next recording Magical Diaries? It will probably be this weekend. We try to get together once a week to do one of each episode. So we'll do a, a Magical Diaries, we'll do a Lauren, we'll do a Fading Hearts. But uh, anyway, yeah, I don't think we're doing that quest. I don't want that in my inventory right now, so let's stick that in the chest. Should we plant some cotton seeds, guys? What do you think? All right, let's have that wood, we'll have that. We'll go fishing in a bit, I should imagine. Keep that clay safe. I think I know what that hammer is used for. In fact, why don't we try that? If my understanding is correct, we should be able to use the hammer to take this block of cobblestone and turn it into gravel. Then we can take this gravel and turn it into sand. And we can take this sand and turn it into dust. And all of those things, gravel, sand, dust, will um, go through the sifter. And the sifter will give us different things for each one of them. And yes, we can get sugarcane seeds from sifting dirt. Looks like we're going to have to rely on doing that. So that this time gave us some pulverized tin ore. Not exactly what we want, but not bad other than none of this. So let's go and get that cotton planted. So let's put it here, shall we? Like that, and we're going to need a block of earth. We're going to need a. We are going to need a hoe. Might as well just make it out of wood, I suppose. So we've got a wood hoe. Achievement yet to eat the farm. Fire. Like that, that will irrigate. We'll plant our pink, wonderful pink cotton seeds on there and let's see what we get out of it. Presumably cotton. But it's not guaranteed, I would say, and we've got to fill that hole in. I'm actually tempted to make a uh, make a lake there. That would be really quite nice, I think. Just some water there. We can go fishing. That'll be good. Okay, so right, let's have a quick look at some of the rest of the chests. Capitalism, ho! Well, that can be taken both ways, can't it? Right, be resourceful. Completed. Oh, I accidentally did that one. Right, heart, a reward bag, a reward bag. Let's take a reward bag. And... I'm smelting, I'm smelting! We'll look at that one later on, I think. Dust in the wind. Iron or gravel. Placing four broken ores of the same type in a crafting grid will get you gravel ore. Beating this ore with a hammer. We'll get you crushed ore. We'll try that in a bit. Melting stone. This is one I want to look at. So we're going to need to want. We're going to want to make stone. We're going to want to make a crucible, and we're going to want to make an unfired clay bucket. 